What's going on guys? It's John with Long Haul Live Series and I am off work early today. Um, had something happen today at work, but I did want to show you that Morgan is up on the roof helping our friend cock her roof. And if anyone knows Morgan, she does not get on the roof. So this is a rare occasion. So let's show you this. <music> I'm not going to be able to go back to work until the 8th, which is okay because I was able to move some of my days around towards the end of the week uh, in the next week. So hopefully it works out. We'll find out. That's what Workman's Comp's for, right? So this is why I am down for the count today, actually for a few days. So this happened at work today. I was moving a patient out of a chair into the bed, got him into the bed, no problem. Went to move the bariatric chair. The rail across the bottom ran across my foot and fractured my toe and rip off the nail. So if you're squeamish, look away because I'll put some pictures on there right now because I know some of you like to see disgusting stuff like I do. So guys, it is day three, three of excuse you of John's boo boo foot. <laughs> and if you guys have been following along with us, you know that Quinn, the dog on his lap, um, she had her broken toenail all the way down to the quick and had to be in a little cast. And the entire time, John called her Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> so. Now I'm about, Lieutenant Dan. Yeah, now it's John's Lieutenant Dan. But she's been very sympathetic. Anytime I have my foot down, she's like trying to lick it. And like every time I have to soak my foot, she's laying right next to my foot. Yeah, she wants to know what's going on. And every time he wraps it with a new, what's that called, Coban? Coban, yeah. Yeah, she's looking at it like, I know what that is. That's awful. Let me let me help you. Yeah, tries to pull it off of me. And... She's definitely our nurturer. Mia doesn't yeah. care. As long as you give me a food and a cold place to sleep. Right. She's fine. So with John having all this downtime, he has now created honeydew list for me. <laughs> so <Quinn. laughs> So I absolutely hate hate. I don't care. Heights don't bother me at all. When I'm on the roof, it's not a big deal. It's getting onto and off of the ladder is what bothers me. Kim convinced me to get off the ladder and then get back on the ladder and and now I'm a pro, so if you need your roof done, give me a call. <laughs> you know, someone was saying the other day, I don't remember who it was, maybe it was Kim, that she had her RV serviced by somebody and essentially all they did was, the like AC. the video we did, which we'll post up here, um, and it cost her like $250. To blow out the ACs. That's I'm crazy. in the wrong business. That takes all of 30 minutes. Like, yeah. there's, So if you're in Albuquerque and need your uh, <laughs> ACs fixed, 250 bucks, and I'll do it. You, what are you gonna do, Gimp? You I will hobble up. up there for 250 bucks. <laughs> yes. No. So um, we will be having a video soon because um, you saw the video of me up on Kim's roof. What we did was we decocked her roof and then recocked her roof. Um, so we will be doing that soon to our RV. Yep. We also will have a video on lap seal coming up also. Yeah, we'll probably put it in the same video, honestly. Probably. Yeah, because they're kind of the same. Yeah. One of the same. Pretty much. I found out that I have been missing out on an entire world of views yeah. from the roof. You can see, almost you can see Albuquerque. It's beautiful up there. Yeah, we were going to get up there and watch fireworks, but since uh, Emperor Gresham didn't allow any fireworks, we didn't see anything. This is the 1 4th of July. We didn't see any fireworks. Not a single one. But it is so dry here with the wildfires and everything. They didn't allow any of it so in a way i'm kind of glad that people obeyed it because i really don't want to have to move the rv for a wildfire this dog's ridiculous she has a bony butt so john has three more days before he has to go possibly back to work yeah i have to uh ow, okay you need to get out so i have a call in on the 7th to the health off people um, and they're just gonna ask like if I can walk and if it's still painful and all that kind of stuff And they'll tell me if I'm allowed to come back or not. But it hurts There's a Mia here stuck to it. It's still swollen That's because it's broke. I know hold on. Let me see Yeah, this part's still kind of black and blue right here 
but you can't really see it in the video. It's really swollen. Fun times. How do you like being taken care of? I don't. <laughs> he's used to being the nurse, not the patient. And let me tell you, he's a horrible patient. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. He doesn't How? listen. He doesn't behave. How? Because, like, he's supposed to be wearing a boot. If I'm walk, if I'm around walking. You walked a lot without the boot on. I don't know what you did. No. But only because I've made him put it on. He was gonna go to Walmart and walk with no boot on, and I said you have to wear it. And then I tried to make him ride in one of those scooters, and he wouldn't do it. No. And he said, "No, I'm fine. It doesn't hurt." And guess what? Today it hurts. Listen. Ah, uh, Nurse Morgan was right. Listen. Now Quinn's bugging me. <laughs> She's just. That's that's her natural. Oh, here Easy. she comes, here she comes. She can't leave him for longer than two minutes. <laughs> so show them your your awesome footwear. <laughs> That's what he's supposed to wear all the time. Velcro, y'all. It looks like a bowling shoe. <laughs> and it's not comfortable uh, to walk in. Gwen, so Jesus, stop. Yeah, but it doesn't, it doesn't bend, so it keeps your foot flat so you don't like, put pressure on your toes or any or it doesn't bend your toes up or anything like that so hi i guess thank it does you. what it's supposed to thank you for all those kisses <laughs> what <laughs> nothing john didn't press record and we did a no. great exit listen a lot no. happened i did press record my camera just shut out god gwen <coughs> just lay down all 40 pounds of her goes into one paw Okay, so that's going to be it for today's episode, guys. Just wanted to give you an update on what's going on with me and with us and the wonderful world of RVing. Until next time, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and then head on over to Instagram. Follow us at Long Haul Life Series. See you guys. Bye.